Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel and welcome to my new video all about my favourite occasion dresses. So I want to show you guys some of my absolute favourite dresses for occasions such as a wedding, uh, a christening, races, all that kind of thing. So they're just really nice, kind of more premium dresses. Most are very reasonably priced. I have got some more expensive ones, but most are reasonably priced. I will leave all the links below. So let's just get straight into it. So first of all, we have this beautiful floral dress. So it is fitted all the way down to the floor, so I'll show you the length in a minute. I paired it with just a plain copper rose gold watch and just some gold earrings. I absolutely love the print. I think it is so flattering. You can also wear a normal bra. A lot of um, like occasion dresses, you have to be careful what bra you wear. But yeah, this dress is so beautiful. I love it. If I did have a wedding or anything coming up, I would absolutely wear this dress. I have got a wedding, but it's my sister's wedding and I'm gonna be a bridesmaid, so I've already got my dress. But if I did have a wedding where it wasn't anything, then this dress would totally be the one that I choose because it is so beautiful. I love the back. I literally just love everything about it. This dress is perfect. So here is the bottom of this dress. As you can see, it's got a slit, but it's not like super short. I'll say it's a pretty reasonable length. So yeah, just a perfect dress. I love the length because it is super long, but with the slit, it still makes it a little bit different. So yeah, beautiful dress. I've just put these pink velvet heels on, which I actually got last season. So I'm not sure if they're still available. If they are, I will link it below, of course. This is the next dress I got. I love this dress. I'm going to say about them all, and I'm going to say I love this dress about them all, but I really do like this dress. It's like a real nudey pink, like a pale pink colour. Don't worry, they're not all pink. I did get some other colours. I thought I can't just get a whole load of pink dresses. So don't worry, there is different dresses coming, but this one was beautiful, I thought. So it's got really thin, like, spaghetti straps as you can see there, and I actually don't have um, a bra on. I don't think like, you need to wear a bra with this dress. You might do, it depends, but you can get those stick on bras. I think that would probably look good with this dress. But yeah, just a beautiful dress. I've kept on just the gold earrings I had to go with the first dress. I thought they'd go really nice with this dress as well. Kept on the same shoes. But I love the way this kind of goes like peplum at the bottom. So it is actually that short, and then it's got those on which will just be so flowy i think it's really really flattering here it is from the back just another beautiful dress this one is actually really reasonably priced as well so everything will be linked below as i've already said i got this really cute bag to go with this dress i thought it would look so nice i love the color uh, i love the fact it's got a really cute gold chain i think it just looks really nice with the dress and that's a really reasonably priced as well you guys know i love to get the bargain so yeah here it is up close just a cute bag basically and I think it goes really nicely with this dress so this dress is a 10 out of 10 for me I absolutely love it this next dress is a bit of a wild card what do you guys think it has like a puffy don't know what you'd call this neckline thing um it's a really really loud print which I love I mean I love colorful stuff I don't think you can ever be too much colorful so I really do like this dress but it's definitely a bit different and I know it won't be to everyone's taste so here is what it looks like from the back it's a silky material, it is quite fitted, like, out of all the dresses, this is the one I felt most restricted in, definitely. But I think it's really different, and I really like it. I think it would be great at the races, like, with a fascinator, all that kind of thing. So what do you guys think of this dress? Let me know. I know that it is a little bit different, and not something I would usually wear. I have paired it with just the gold earrings again. These gold earrings are going with everything, and then with a the gold watch. I don't think you can go wrong with just some subtle earrings um, and a watch. I don't think you should overdo it with jewellery. I think less is definitely more sometimes, especially for a dress like this that does all the talking itself. I also think it looks nice to have your hair up as well, especially when the dress does all the talking like this one. So here is the next dress I have to show you guys. This is actually misguided at ASOS. So all of these dresses are from ASOS, but this is misguided at ASOS. I think it's one of the cheapest ones from the group. So I love this because it's off the shoulder. I love the bottom as well, so I'll show you that in a minute. But I love the sleeves. It's like um, a scuba netted material, if you can see. So it's like fishnet scuba material. So it's really, really nice. I've again paired it with the gold earrings again, obviously, and my watch. But yeah, a really, really nice dress. Definitely a little bit different as well. So here is the bottom. And the bottom is definitely my favourite part of this dress because I love the way it goes down at the back. So it's like longer at the back um yeah i think it's quite flattering especially from the back 
it is a really reasonably priced as well as i've already said so if you are on a budget these kind of dresses could suit your budget and actually even though they are cheaper they are actually really well made like this dress is super thick so it is really well made so just so don't think just because you're paying less it won't be as good that's not always the way this dress is definitely really well made bag wise i've got this bag to go with this dress it's just a gray suede bag with a little gold tassel i thought it'd go nice with this dress because this dress is all pink and it's quite a a strong pink i didn't think putting a pink bag would then look great so i thought break it up a bit just put any kind of neutral color so gray perfect for me i love gray pink and gray are like my favorite colors so putting just a nice gray bag with it kind of breaks it up here is a closer view of the bag it's quite spacious as well there's quite a lot of room in this bag so here is the next dress and this is actually the most expensive dress i'm going to show you guys today and do you know what when you put it on you can feel the quality like I feel like genuinely free in this dress. You can move, like it's not restricting. I think it's really, really pretty. I absolutely love the print. This is one of my favorites, totally. Even though it is more expensive, like you can kind of tell why you have to pay more for this kind of dress. You just feel so free. I guess it is the type of dress it is as well. That's why it is so like loose and comfortable but it is literally the comfortablest dress out of today's selection i absolutely love it again i've just paired it with the gold earrings uh the pink suede shoes but yeah this is such a beautiful dress for me if i was going to an occasion i would spend around this kind of price point for the dress i think it was around 120 but i'll link it below for the exact price but i would actually spend that kind of price point especially for a dress this beautiful yeah, I really, really love it. It's obviously pink, it's sheer, so it has um, like another dress kind of underneath, so you can't, so it's not see-through. And then it has this kind of lace fabric over the top. But yeah, a really, really beautiful dress. This next dress I've got, I got because I thought it kind of tied in with the whole royal wedding thing. This is a dress that I kind of imagine that a royal might wear because it is quite, um, what's the word? What's the word? Ah, sophisticated. Because it's really sophisticated, that's the word I was looking for. Um, yeah, because it's got long sleeves as well as quite a decent length. I love the detailing on it as well, so it's quite glamorous as well. So I thought kind of royal theme. So there is a detailing. It is scuba material, so it's really thick, good material. And it is like skater style, so it is tight at the top and then flares out just like so i absolutely love it it's really nice and definitely kind of a royal theme probably not something i would choose immediately but if you did want to be super sophisticated then this is kind of the dress for you i think it is a thicker material so it might be a bit warm if it's going to be a really hot day so this kind of might be better for the early summer months or the late summer to spring months but this is a beautiful dress, really well made. I love the colour as well. I think the colour is beautiful. I love bright colours, as you can probably tell. So this is a bonus outfit. I wasn't actually going to put this in the video, but I was trying it on. And my friend Claire was like, you need to put that in the video. Like, that is so nice. So it's actually a play suit. It's not a dress. It is beautiful. It's from River Island, so not ASOS. This is the only one that isn't from ASOS. Then I paired it with these um gold wedges which i absolutely love they are so nice as an outfit together i love it i was worried when i got this play suit that it might be a little bit revealing like the neck might be too low but it, it falls perfectly so it's not too low at all and then there is the back i'm not wearing a white bra with it but i'll wear a different bra when i actually wear it and then it's not actually too short either so i'm really really happy with this play suit and i feel like wearing a play suit to a wedding or an occasion is a little bit different you can also have this one casual as well so i'm actually going to wear this in a few days and i'm going to put a denim jacket over it to make it look really casual so i love this one so i'm going to show you guys my special guest claire she's come around to help me out today and she's the one that said i had to show you guys this outfit so come on camera claire here she is <laughs> and look how pregnant she is so when will you do uh, five days ago, so... You're five days overdue. Yeah. Oh, my God. So when this video goes live, which will be Wednesday, which is tomorrow, um, you, we might have a baby. We're not sure yet. We don't know. I think he's going to hang on a little longer. Yeah, I reckon too. I honestly think yeah. he's going to be so overdue. I think Saturday, Sunday. I was two weeks overdue with my first baby, and I know how you're feeling. He may be, on the ro he may be born on the royal wedding. He might be born on the yeah, royal wedding, yeah. So. Might be like a, a new royal baby, but... Yeah. Yeah. 
So wish Claire good luck, everyone. I know she'll do absolutely fabulous. Thank you. So here's the last dress I'm gonna show you guys. This dress is beautiful. I love yellow, especially as a Michelle Keegan wore it to the BAFTAs. I thought she looked amazing. It's such a beautiful color and I really love it. I feel like it goes with all skin tones. I absolutely love this dress. So here is the full length. So it is tight all the way down. So it's yellow crochet and it's got like a nude slip underneath. It, it is all tied together though, so you can't really like pull it apart or anything. And then the sleeves are so cute. I love this dress so much. My mum came around and saw it and she absolutely loved it. It was her favorite one of the whole lot. Uh, yes, the sleeves, they got cute yellow bows on the sleeves and then here it is from behind. So this is a beautiful dress. I absolutely love it. It is reasonably priced as well for the quality, but the quality is amazing. It's really, really well made, so it's totally worth it. I feel like this is perfect for a wedding if you are a guest at a wedding. It's classy, sophisticated, as well as being a bit fun and a little bit different. A beautiful colour. Absolutely love this dress. Here you can see the material up close. As you can see, it's yellow crochet, then with a nude slip underneath. So that's the end of my video, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please give me a big thumbs up. Let me know in the comments section what your favorite dress was. I would love to know. My favorite dress was probably the first floral one, the super expensive pink lacy one, or this one, I love the yellow. So let me know. I'd really love to hear what you guys like. And I'll see you guys in my next video.